So Rush was originally uh, choreographed on the San Francisco Ballet in the early 2000s. It is set to Martin News, uh, Sinfonietta La Jolla. It's in three movements, it's about 20 minutes long. And um, I think that uh, Rush is one of Christopher's great works in the, in the way that it really represents his style. And it's, uh, and it's very quick, articulate, and uh, definitely has a virtuosic character about it. I think that Christopher is a very, very important choreographer to the international dance community. And the fact that his work is very relevant in a classical ballet company, any, any company in the world could do his work. His vocabulary is very similar to very, very classical style of a ballet. Um, I think that it's important to have a living choreographer that can stand up today and have really, really important work that is representative of the ballet world. I think the Hong Kong Ballet Company is fantastic. Uh, the dancers have been lovely to work with. They're very quick. Uh, we've gotten through this learning process very fast, uh, which is always which is always wonderful. Um, and I think that there's a really wide range of talent within this company, which is very nice. You've got uh, classical ballet mixed with some neoclassical styles, and when you blend those two things together, it's the perfect combination for Rush. There's no storyline to Rush. It is just about dance and the music. So um, when you're watching it, you, you may be able to make up a story if you like, but there's no intent behind that. It's an abstract piece. Rush has only been uh, performed by a select few companies around the world. Um, so it's, it's a, not one of those ballets that's done too, too many times. So I think that's very important for Hong Kong to have, to know that they are getting a ballet of Christopher Wielden's that is, is, is somewhat very special, and that he decided that this company would look the best doing.